LNDTV's Nazir Masoodi now joins us on the phone line for more on this. Uh, Nazir, what's the update at this point in time? Have they managed to actually get some of those people who were buried alive under that avalanche uh, out? Paji, uh, rescue operation has been removed in, uh, resumed in that area. Uh, there was heavy snowfall during the night and uh, it is really very hostile weather conditions and hostile terrain in in that particular area near the line of control in Uri sector where 15 people including 7 army men among them one JCO have come under an avalanche last evening two bodies of army men have been uh, recovered yesterday now the uh, rescue operation has been remo uh, resumed uh, but it is really very difficult situation for the uh, rescue team because it is really a uh, very difficult terrain and there are fears of more avalanche in the area so army has to be very very cautious before going ahead and resume uh, uh, to recover the bodies they are they say they they fear that all these 15 people have, they have died under under this avalanche uh, army used to uh, you know abandon these peaks on high altitude areas near the line of control but after kargil incursion kargil war when pakistani army occupied some peaks in kargil area so army is now manning these uh, peaks along the li line of control through the winter and uh, they were earlier uh, avoiding such kind of uh, these uh, things uh, like the nature threat because of heavy snowfall in these in these areas. But right. since there is a possibility that Pakistani army may come there and they may uh, do the same thing what they did in Kargil, army is not taking any chances. Right, uh, Nazim Masoodi joining us there. Those rescue operations still on, but uh, hampered by uh, more snow in the region where we'll get you.